Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. If this is your first time visiting this channel, don't forget to subscribe, like and share this video and also hit the notification bell for all the upcoming videos. Today I'm going to teach you uh, four blues licks that you can use uh, when you're playing the 12 bar blues. So we're going to start with the first lick, which is once again. So I'm going to play it slowly for you guys. One more time. So this lick here that you could use it, you could use it with any sound on the piano. And we start from C. And now I'm playing G and C together. So G and C. But I'm sliding from F sharp to the G. So C sliding from F sharp to the G. So this is the, the first part of the lick. After that, I play C again, and then I play F and A together. And then I play C again. This is a C major, but sliding from the E flat. And then I play an A. So from the C major here, sliding from the E flat. A, G, C. So. So when you play it fast, it, it sounds really good. So once again, slowly. So this is the first lick that you can use on the 12 bar blues. The second one is... So this one is a very easy one. So the notes are C. So again, sliding from E flat to E, G, A, C. So this is the second one. And the third one is Again. So this one is, again, I'm sliding from the F sharp to G, so G and C together. So, so G and C, then F. E flat C then we play B flat and E flat together and then we just start again so once again sliding from F sharp to G and C together F E flat C B flat E flat together sliding again from F sharp to G and C together, F, E flat, C. So 
This is the third lick that you can use and the C blues scale, I mean. The fourth lick that you can use when you're playing the 12 bar blues is So C, B flat, G, F, E flat, F, G, F, E flat, C, B flat, G, F. So this is the fourth lick. C, B flat, G, F, E flat, F, G, F, E flat, C, B flat, G, F. So. So once again, the first one is, second one, the third one, and the fourth one, So once again, the first one is, second one, the third one, and the fourth one. So those are the four licks that you guys can practice uh, from the blues scale. So when you're playing the 12 bar blues, make sure you could uh, practice them and try to learn them, memorize the, those licks. And when you play the 12 bar blues, you could try to use them in solo. So once again, So thank you guys for watching this video and if you have any questions just leave it in the comments below and if you haven't done so please subscribe like and share this video and also hit the notification bell for all the upcoming videos i'll see you guys in the next video